What is going on, ladies and gentlemen of the internet? I'm that chunky guy. Today, I'm bringing you more Titanfall beta gameplay. And it's going to be a little bit different of a commentary today. Uh, I want to talk about the potential and the possibility of there being competitive Titanfall once, once the game comes out. As of now, there will be no competitive Titanfall on the release date um it the game itself is not being released with private lobbies which is of which of course makes it impossible for there to be competitive you know there can there can't be teams that um they just can't get in lobbies and, and play each other practice against each other etc but that is the main reason right now that there can be uh, that there's no way there can be competitive Titanfall as the day comes out. The day comes out. But, uh, they are working on adding a private lobby to the game. So once, uh, that update comes out where, uh, the private lobbies are added to the game, I want to talk about the possibilities of the competitive scene uh, changing to adapt to a new competitive game, uh, Titanfall, obviously. Uh, but there are a few big points and a few minor points that I want to talk about. Um, a big point being uh, the bots, the anime AI. Uh, if you've if you've played the beta already, you know that there are on the map there are two sets of enemy AI, the grunts and the specters. Um, if there was to be competitive in Titanfall, there's no possible way it could be done with these bots in the game. Um, once they come out with the private lobby, uh, there needs to be an option to take the bots out. Um, competitive cannot be played with enemy AI. It would change the entire game. Um, it would no longer be just team skill based, you know, there would just be distractions of enemy bots, and I'm sure you could come up with other reasons on why, uh, why the bots can't be in the game, but if you have, uh, if you know anything about competitive, you know that, you, you know yourself that there can be no bots, enemy AI, whatever you want to call it, uh, in the game at the same time. Uh, it would just it would it would change the game dramatically. Um, another point is the maps, uh, which kind of goes along with the bots, the anime. Uh, if you've played the beta, you know obviously we've only seen two maps, so I c I can't really judge this just on these two maps, but I think competitive would be very slow very boring to watch if the maps uh, every map in the game was the size of this because competitive team is only four on four and with the size of these maps four on four you'd just be struggling you'd be struggling to find you'd be struggling to find people to kill um, it, it would be boring to watch more than half the game you'd just be running around looking for people but that's 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 another big thing that uh that goes with the bots because obviously with the bots they take up a lot of the map so it seems like there's more action going on um there needs to be smaller maps so that it can compensate for not having those enemy ai distractions on the map at the same time another thing i want to bring up is the game modes and obviously, I'm only going off uh, the stuff that I have seen, uh, experienced in the beta. So there are many possibilities of what the real game could still have to offer. Uh, but with the game modes that they've offered us uh, to play in the beta, there's only one, which is the one I'm playing right now. Hardpoint Domination uh, is the only game mode that can be played competitively. Uh, the only other game, two game modes that uh, they had in the game, in the beta, were attr Attrition, I believe it was called, which is a team deathmatch, which uh, n no possible way 
uh, can it be a, a competitive game type? Um, you know, in any competitive game, there's no such thing as a team deathmatch. Uh, and the other one was uh, Last Titan Standing, which, I mean, it could be a competitive game type, but I don't think it would be, just because you, it's it's only Titans. Uh, there's no actually, there's no gunfights in there. But I mean, I I guess it might be able to squeeze and find a spot uh, in the competitive game modes uh, if this game were to have some. But that's um that's something that needs to be put in consideration too. Uh, right now, with the game mode we've seen. Uh, uh, this uh, this hard point domination one is the only one uh, that for sure can be used as a competitive game mode. Um, another thing, another kind of a big thing, goes with the money making potential uh, that Titanfall can have if it does indeed adapt to competitive. Um, I have been a fan for competitive for not even probably not even a year uh, and I can speak for myself when I say uh, I'm a big competitive Call of Duty fan but you know it's just it's getting boring uh, it, Black Ops 2 kinda saved competitive uh, for first person shooters um, it did with, with the game with the game modes and uh, and the maps and just you know it was fun to watch but with Call of Duty Ghosts it they just delivered so poorly on it and I think Titanfall could save uh, first person shooters uh, in the competitive aspect um, this this game is such a hyped game that I think uh, many people will be buying it just because of that uh, and I can speak for myself also when I say that uh, not just because I played the game, but because it just it's hugely anticipated. But if it does indeed take over the competitive first person shooters, the amount of sponsors, the amount of peop extra people that they get to buy the game, it it could bring it could bring the company and the game so much more money that I think they they really have to look at adapting to competitive. Um, but that's pretty much all the points I have, guys. If you can come up with any other reasons, uh, any other things that I missed, feel free to put that in the comments below. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the video, guys. If you did, be sure to leave a thumbs up. Uh, I've been trying to, I've been trying to get on a, on a regular uploading basis. Um, I mean, I haven't, I've, I've done two videos today, so I hope to, kind of develop a schedule whether it's uh, one video a day or one video every other day uh, but I do hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in my next video That shield is like small thing. Oh, this is a big sun. Big sun! Big sun! Let's go! Yeah. Yeah, so, um. Oh, and you're not inviting me?